Hey, what's up guys? So, for this video, um, I'm going to demonstrate and show you guys um, how to use vinegar to clean the water pot. I hear this pot, it's really dirty, it's been, never been cleaned for, I don't know, maybe a few years now. So let me show you guys how dirty exactly is. I hope the light shows it. Uh, how's that? It's not really focused. Let me, you know what, let's go outside. Okay, so how's this, guys? I don't know if you guys can see the focus. Right there, that's all that stain and everything builds up. All the, I don't know what you call it, the carbon, not carbon, or something, builds up in here. Um, probably in here is too, really dirty. Yeah, if you get the angle right, it's not really focusing yet. This is pretty dirty as well. So, I guess the way how you clean it is use the vinegar. I don't really have an actual vinegar. I got this vinegar red wine, so a little bit higher class vinegar. Uh, let's see if it works. So you basically, what you want, well obviously I don't have a lot. <coughs> but if you do have the regular one, that would be great. Try to cover the whole thing. I'm not saying you have to fill it all the way up, but based on this thing, it's pretty dirty. Even the the meter thing, the the thing that the thing that right there, this thing that is measuring the measuring. I don't know if that's the coil. Maybe that's the heater coil or something. But the point is that thing is probably pretty dirty as well. So if I actually had like a full tank or full bottle of uh, vinegar, like just normal vinegar. I'll probably fill it up to 75% or 50 and then add the rest with the water to uh, boil it. One finger open. Okay. So since I don't have it, I'm just going to use this point and then my goal is just try and cover it as much as possible. And let's try see if it works. At least try to get a little bit of uh, bottom off. Point kind of slowly right now. Alright, uh, how's that? That's pretty good. Pretty good amount. I'm just going to swivel around. You know, try to see if it cover as much area as possible. Smell pretty good. Yeah, it smell pretty good. You know what I'm also going to do is I'm going to pour some from the top right here. On the tip down. Oops, some some of it came off, and that's it. Let's see what happened. Let me close this. Close this thing up. Put it on the side. Let me do a good shake. Come on, very good shake. Um, and then I want to pour a little bit out as well. Not all the way out, just try to get the tip of it. I guess I don't know if I explained this right. Oh, nope, that's not what I want. This one. Nope, that's good. Yep. Yeah. And next, what you want to do is add a little bit of water into it. Um, so, if you add like one cup of, of vinegar, Put 50 50 percent of one cup half of it uh i don't remember how much i don't exactly remember how much vinegar i put but roughly so i don't really have measurement turn it on let's flip over okay, probably can't really see it let me scroll around a little bit more and now you wait just let it boil so i'm gonna pause this okay so it's been like I don't know, 15 seconds. As you see, it's boiling, smoking coming out. The reason why it's boiling and smoking because the vinegar causing it. Usually hot water, regular water, it shouldn't smoke as bad as this. But with the vinegar, it's creating the bubble inside. And it just finished. 
don't know if you hear that. It just stopped. Still had that bubble. Let me shake it around a little bit. Ow. Wow, some of the liquid just kind of came out from the top and dropped on my hand. That was kind of hot. Well, anyway, be careful. You should really wear a glove, I guess. Uh, let me just shake it. Slowly shaking it. I don't want that just to happen again. Uh, let me swirl around. Try and get that heat. Let me pop it in. Let me do it twice. Second time. Burning it. It should be quick because it's still hot. So it should boil instantly. Anyway, reach the certain temperature, it'll stop by itself. Look at that smoke coming out. That's all that vinegar evaporating. Okay, so let's shake it around a little bit. <coughs> Ooh, that really good strong. Let me quickly peek at it, see how's it look. Uh, I will say it's not perfect. It's better. It's still not perfect. It probably need to have that vinegar sit inside for a little bit, you know. But I don't know if you guys can see it it's, uh, right there. It's still got that dark round area in the middle, but the edges on the side, it's all cleaning up a lot. So for sure it's working. Um, but it will need more vinegar maybe have it sit so maybe I'll leave it in I'm just gonna leave this vinegar in and let it sit let it cool down and see what happened all right guys it's been like five minutes I'm too lazy to wait for the liquid to cool down as you see there's still smoke coming out um, you know normally you should have it you know sit and cool everything down and then you pour it out but you know, not not that not as soak, not the vinegar does its work. You know, on the on the pot, but I'm too lazy to wait, so I'm going to do it. And I think another reason why it doesn't clean everything out is because there wasn't enough vinegar. Maybe because uh, this is a red wine vinegar. It's not completely a hundred percent vinegar, so that's probably also not enough vinegar inside. Um, so I'm not gonna wait and test this out uh, as long as I knew that it clean I would say more than 50% of uh, these nasty stain on the pot out so that's good enough I'm just gonna pour everything out right now yep. pour in the, and after you pour everything out obviously you want to rinse it <coughs> you want to rinse a few times get all the um, get all the vinegar taste where wine tastes to out of it um, you know as I pour this out if you could see from the tip of it look at that it cleaned the whole mouth of this opening right here this mouth yeah but as for the bottom one those stain the circle stain you're looking at those probably need vinegar to be sit inside there for I don't know a few hours or maybe a days to to just de soften up those stain or decrease those but other than that I think it does its job uh, I think it's pretty good um, it's a lot better than the original before so now it's good enough to mix some hot water well anyway thanks for watching guys if you have any questions leave a comments